Well, with an uptick in bed bug infestations, two companies, Spada and Comcast Machine Q, are joining forces and using what else? Technology and AI. So joining me now to talk about their partnership are Spada CEO Robert Fryers and head of product and strategy at Comcast Machine Q, Brian Witkowski. Uh, gentlemen, thanks so much for joining. And uh, Robert, we'll start with you here. Tell us more about this partnership, how it came to be, and what the goals are. Yeah. So we've been making monitors for bed bugs for a few years now. They're these little guys. They tuck underneath the mattress, out of the way, out of sight, and tell hotel owners when there's a problem so they can prevent guests from getting bitten. And we've had some really great traction over in Europe. Uh, but what we were looking for was a partner who could help us expand that into the North American market, obviously the biggest hotel market in the world, and also, unfortunately, one that has quite significant problems with bed bugs. And I got chatting to Brian and the idea of bringing the latest and greatest tech that we had and partnering up with a company like Comcast, it's a no brainer. So Brian, uh, with bed bug detection surpassing the total for 2023, by March 15th, what specific challenges or trends in this industry really prompted this? Yeah, we, we've been developing Internet of Things technology specific for the hospitality industry for the last three years and, and doing things like staff, staff safety buttons, leak detection, humidity, and talking to a lot of ownership groups. And as we presented all the things we're doing, one of those ownership groups said, can you help me detect bed bugs? And we were stumped. But thankfully, we were able to find Robert and his team and help bring that to the market. And we're at the early stages of that. But for hoteliers, it from a, the most luxury brands down to economy brands, there's a massive concern. And with this innovative tech that can address that and really put guest mind at ease, we're seeing a ton of interest. Robert, how does Spada's AI technology work in conjunction with Machine Q's IoT network platform to provide this early detection? Sure. So there's, there's basically two stages of that. So we provide these monitors. They go out of the way, under the bed. They track bugs inside here, and then we detect them and identify whether it's a bed bug or whether it's something else. And we send that data using the backhaul that Machine Q provide and the all of the service provision that they have to get that information to the front of house. And typically, it's going to reception staff, it's going to the maintenance crew, it might go straight to their pest control company so that they can get in and deal with it before it becomes a problem, before anyone gets bitten. And Brian, elaborate on the benefits uh, that hotels can expect uh, from implementing this early detection system. I, well, I think what we're at the earliest stages and, and there's a lot of sensitivity when you're talking to hoteliers and you're, you're saying bed bugs, it helps to say it in a very low tone. Um, but what we're seeing, um, and Robert's team is leading the way in Europe, is letting the guests know that this preventive service is there and put their minds at ease rather than have to worry about checking in, checking bed sheets, turning on the lights, and knowing that they can put this technology, it's reliable, it's based on a global standard, and is backed by Comcast and Spada, um, gives a lot of credence to the technology and confidence that it's going to work over time. And Robert, what do you find are the key features of the Spada pads, uh, pods, excuse me, and Machine Q's IoT platform that does make it well suited uh, for hotel bed bugs that could be, again, a scalable solution? So there are three main parts of that. One of them is it's affordable. You know, we have done surveys of, of travelers in, in you know, Europe and in North America. And the consistent message is, yeah, I'll pay more. I will spend more to stay in a hotel that's keeping me safe. And actually the average response we get is about five bucks a night. It's a significant amount. Our cost is a tiny fraction of that. So that's one of the things that historically there hasn't been something that can be done affordably. Secondly, it's reliable. You, know, you fit it and you forget about it. It's a one touch, easy installation. And then once you're there, you're backed you know, with a highly reliable service that's gonna work day in, day out and protect you 24 seven. Historically, hotels, if they had a, a problem with bed bugs, they might not know about it for weeks and you can get a lot of bed bugs in a few weeks. Uh, well, Brian, how does this partnership plan to address potential privacy concerns related to using AI and IoT devices in hotels? Yeah, there's, there's a ton of sensitivity, especially when you talk about guests, guest experience, putting things in the room. Thankfully, as we're part of Comcast, we apply the most rigorous cybersecurity standards to our product end-to-end. -end. And we think about working with Spada, all the data that's shared is encrypted from the device, across our network, all the way to the cloud. And, and we hold, hold ourselves to the highest security standards to for the guests' sake of peace of mind and, and the hotel owners and management groups. So, Robert, with a system already in use in Europe and now expanding into the U.S., what do you see as the future plans of deploying and adopting uh, this technology on a bigger scale? 
Yeah, so I mean, we've recently broken into a couple of the really big names, you know, the, the, the groups, here, the household names that everyone will know, um, and getting written into brand standards of those. This, for us, you, know, you wouldn't dream of staying in a hotel that didn't have smoke detectors for fire. Bed bugs, a similar category, right? This is the smoke detector for bed bugs. This is just becomes a standard part of the safety equipment that every property just has to have. That's our vision for this. And Brian, how would you say that this partnership aligns with the broader goals and the vision of Spada and Machine Q in revolutionizing this kind of management of pests and IoT solutions for other industries? Uh, yeah, so and what we see in multiple verticals, it, it helps to have an incredible use case like bed bug, bed bug detection, but no one's deploying this network and the supporting technology for one use case alone. So the value is we can bring in a very innovative product like Spada, but we can also bring in our own solutions, other third parties in a rich ecosystem to make that value really um, comprehensive for a hotel management group. All right, uh, guys, thanks so much for joining. Robert Fryer, CEO of Spada, and Brian Witowski. Uh, head of products and strategy at Comcast Machine Q.